Assalamu alaikum guys this is me Senpai Gamer San I'm your host Senpai we are playing the game Tunnels and Trolls The adventure begins with the meta adventures There was a guy who keeps saying hello hello and we try to contact with him He told us that he is some kind of spectral universal man who can jump on different timelines and different universe So he gave me the an offer that I should explore the different times of universe and the adventure with him well you can't say no to this guy because he knows something about me and myself so we say yes in the chapter 1 there's kendant i was really a lovely adventure guy well it's on our blood i killing the imaginary friends because i can't kill the I'm oh, sorry imaginary monster not friends imaginary monsters in my mind because I can't kill them in real then until I grow up my family left only the person left is my mom she is dying she told me that I have to do something to save myself in the city of Iskandar in the tunnels of Kaladesh well I decided to become a blacksmith and uh, guess what happened I creating the weapons for the Kladish people and got the Kladish hammer I thought I am living this city but I couldn't but soon we find out the Kladish tunnels I was the adventure I decided to explore that tunnel When we go into the tunnel we face different kind of situation and horrible adventures wait for us we save the barbarian we win the honor of kladish through the zombies and finally the kladish tunnels curse broke we decided to leave that tunnels and leave the city too we then land on the another city soon i found the tavern while i was finding the job to you know collect the gold and silver for survive the city i was working on the tavern tavern sorry tavern is the thing where you is a hotel some kind of in short we can a hotel where people live in you know giving buying the house just for few weeks Okay then where was I then I was telling my story about my bravery to the lady so I can flirt with her <laughs> but then the another guy came out he is the mayor of this town he told me that there was a son of a warrior he is sick horribly by the curse of the mage mage is the person who doing the magician in short it's a wizard sorry so the wizard gave the curse to a boy who is sick horribly and then mayor told me to find the potion to nullify the curse in the buffalo castle we go to the buffalo castle and believe me guys it was the maze run a really horrible maze run we explore the buffalo castle fully we face a horrible situation medusa and another's people there another's like a evil person when we explore all entire traps magicals and we find the wizard but that wizard doesn't help full for us he is just doing the magic and fucked up everything anyway but we finally here right now we soon find out that the warrior son i mean the warrior mother is inside the castle she is protecting the potion guarding the potion so no one can took it i explore the mission she don't believe me you guys can see it in my previous video and then i have to fight with her i keep trying to kill her she didn't die and guess what she finally trust me and give me the potion i go back and save her son and now we are in the next chapter chapter 3 b
blue floor. Tavran. Well, I guess I come back with the Tavran again. <clears throat> Your project of adventure proves a thirst that is not easy to quench. The desire to see more pushes you ever onward into unexplored. Eventually, you arrive to the plain of Therions, once the farthest outpost of the Harum Empire, now abandoned. It is here that you find the Blue Frog Tower, a hub of the Rune lands, where a gossip in exchange deal are made and all people can grab a drink in peace. So, we gonna go here. Yes. Well, I guess I have to do the fast forward thing so you guys can enjoy this story. Your present of adventure proves a thirst that is not easy to quench. The desire to see more, to do more pushes you ever onward into the unexplored. Having no other viable direction to go in, you head east. That eventually brings you to the plains of Theranos, also known as the Rion Lands. Once upon a time, this was the furthest outpost of the Harum Empire and the first place to be abandoned when the empire fell. For the most part, Theranos is Sapphire's Pyrrhia land. Few trees grow here except where they're protected from the wind by the small rocky hillsides. The few things that to do grow can be hazardous due to the residue of powerful magic cast centuries ago. And it is always a bit muddy due to the near constant drizzling. It is here that you find the Blue Frog Tavron. If there is a hub in the Rune Lands, this is it is where the gossip is exchange. Deals are made and unexpected deals are made and except for the occasional bar fight. It is a place where all the people can grab a drink and please and warm themselves by a fire. A neutral zone, loosely held together by the mutual self-interest, where the drags and the outcasts of all societies and the races congregate. A wooden sign with a blue frog painted on it hangs over the door. In turning the tavern, you make your way through the dimly lit common room and take the seat at a table with your back to the wall as your eyes become accustomed to the lightning you size of the other customers. Across the room beside the bar stand a black bearded dwarf with the patch over his right eye. He is talking to short blue eyed rock demon. A group of hopes sits at the table near the fireplace. Two valenius looking human cast dice. A big mean looking troll leans against the bar. The old bartender is tough looking and covered with a scar but very friendly. You ask the barman about the local gossip and he tells you the new traveler over is looking for a sword for hire. He also tells you a strange new order of the red priests that have been swarming over the countryside causing no end to trouble, interrogating strangers and assaulting anyone who stand up them, their action have hurt the Tavran business and are causing a fair amount of uneasy throughout the Rune lands. As the barman brings you order, fight breaks out between the draft and the rock demon. The rock demon break a bear mug over the draft head. The troll lunches erect, grabs the rock demon with one hand and casually poses him over his shoulder. The rock demon hurtles across the room, slide across your table. Head first into the wall. 
as the rock demon slowly get up and the troll rushes across the room it occurs to you that the first impression are important you should probably do something to let the other patron know the nature of your characters um ha hmm that rock demon is bullshit to be honest i mean he is the one who is attacking the people he is the one fucking who blast the i mean blow up the glass and you guys can hear the voices about the fighting isn't it and by the way great song talk here i love it i go for the rock demon uh, and yeah by the way guys i'm the first pakistani person who playing this kind of story type of game diplomacy what is diplomacy before the bartender can stop you you smash your mug over the rock demon heads and stand him crashing the ground that was the manager of the taran you just cold cock say the cold who had better leave before he wakes up you notice that the troll bouncer coming towards you look of a rage and violence in his eyes oh man i should attack the god damn it i guess i have to restart this game again oh man this is bullshit I want to play honestly man I fucked up here to be honest I don't have to fucked up here Why did I messed up here pretty bad pretty bad Fast forward there You leap out your chair and draw your weapon you get between the rock demon the troll bouncer He had enough you Oh sorry. <clears throat> He had enough. You yell, pointing your weapon at Troll. Just then you feel a tap on your shoulder. It's the Rock Demon. It's okay. He said, "I lost my temper with Draft, and the bouncer was just keeping me from killing him." With that, the Rock Demon bounds over the Draft, helps him up, and dust bits of broken mug off his head. After a short whisper conversation. The rock demon hands over the leather purse. The one I draft hands him a metal horn in return. And then hurry out the tavern, muttering something about the crazy rock demon. The rock demon then grabs a fresh mug of ale and join you at the table. He introduces himself as a quartz and is about to ask you a question when two priests dressed in red robes bus through the tavrans the press looks around the tavern and one of them point a glowing rain stuff in your direction say okay there is the retal rock toad kill him and integrate the stranger he is talking to the troll bouncer throw a bar stool at one and press before they can say anything else it smashes into one pressed head killing him instantly the other press charges your table Blowing stuff in your hand. Die! Unbelievable! He screamed. You seriously, dude, messing up with me? You seriously, dude? Did he that? Ah, he's dead. After you dispatch the red press, the patron, the blue frog, cheer and give a toast in your honor. There are many offers to buy you a drink, which you readily accept. Before you get too drunk on a few drinks, Karts approaches you and offer. I'm looking for a bodyguard to help me with special mission tonight. And I like the way you handle yourself. I want to hire you if you are available. Accept the offer. Now that you agree to help Karts fully explain the situation aside from its advantage location, one of the main reason Blue Frog Tavern has been heaven a real lands. It's because it is protected from all hostile magic by an ancient talisman. Thus look like a blue frog giving the name of Tavern. For centuries this has kept all kinds of power, hungry wizard, mad cults, and even some small armies 
from not only from destroying the Tavran, but shifting the balance of power in Theranos. Sorry, Theranos. Unfortunately, Red Priest have hired some thieves who recently made off with the Talisman, leaving the Blue Frog vulnerable to attack. And once the word gets out about the tough tipped, all hell is going to break on Rune Lands. <clears throat> but I have a plan, or rather three potential plan. Plan one. We head into the sewer system that ruins the beneath all of the Theranos. We will pick up some allies on the way and take the fight to the priest at their home temple. Plan 2. We follow the thieves, escape the route through the old crypt and catch them before they can hand over the talisman. Man, I'm gonna be... Watch this video again once I upload it. Because I didn't read the plan 1. <laughs> Plan 2, we follow the thief, escape route through the old crypt and catch them before they can hand over the talisman. Okay, that's fine. Plan 3, being a rogue demon, I can easily navigate through any cave system, utilizing the cavern under the rune lens. We should be able to get to the crypt exit before the thieves do and ambush them. Okay. Each plan is not without a risk through the sewer. There are their own city community who are just as many enemies down there as friends. The creeps are heavily trapped and may be crawling with undead. Quartz has never been in cave and has no idea what might lurking. Okay. Huh. I guess that's all I guess that's all for now guys we got so many gold right now okay we just kill the staff people and get what we need okay also we save the quads <laughs> I almost trying to kill the person who hit the head and I restart this game well, I guess um, I can't choose. Okay, guys, I leave it up to you guys, to be honest. At the previous time, I choose on my own, but this time, I leave it up to you guys. This game had no walkthrough. I'm the first Pakistani person who reading this game toward you guys and giving you the review about this game. The game is really awesome. I love it. And it needs internet connection worth it and really good game with a great story like a dungeons and dragons you guys can say it also don't forget to subscribe my channel give me the comments and likes let me know what you guys think of this gameplay and then i'm gonna catch you guys inshallah next time in the next video by the way check out my previous gameplay how they i end the chapter 2 walkthrough it is the full walkthrough it's one hour walkthrough i explain the whole freaking castle so you guys can see and enjoy the full story also don't forget to subscribe my channel let me know what you guys think of my gameplay and bye bye take care <clears throat> bye bye take care love you all allah hafiz sayonara pakistan zindabad peace as always in everywhere in every city and in every country Bye-bye.